These are my first attempts at teaching Bell the Ketchner. Um, Bell is pretty thoroughly trained to not cross uh, in back of me. Uh, originally I tried using a ball for a reward. And I'm doing a lot of motion, but nobody explained how to do this uh, or how to teach this, so I'm just kind of stumbling along on my own. I moved that jump on the left closer, hoping that would help. But I'm having to really step back and pick Bell up with my other hand. Okay. Now I'm going in the other direction because you always want to tra uh, train uh, on both sides. Yeah. I am using, um, I, I first try to command around, but actually all my dogs kind of know behind from when we go walking and I have more than one. And it basically means if they've crossed in front of me on leash, they got to cross back around me and they got to do it by going behind me the way they came, which is what I'm trying here now, the behind. And basically I, I really should have started without the jumps and stayed there until Belle was moving behind me, but I had no idea how bad it looked until I watched the video. I increased the criteria by putting her further away from me. She's moving a little better, but I'm still having to do a lot of body language to get her to go around behind me. Now this is more how the maneuver would look on a course and once again she came in the gap because she doesn't really understand and rightfully so. But it's all tricks. When Belle doesn't get it right, I just ignore the behavior, set her up to do it again, and she doesn't get yes on a reward until we get what I wanted. That time I actually wanted her to wrap. Um, set her up, bring her around. Yes, now she gets the cookie. And cookies turned out to be a better choice than the toy. And that was yeah. Belle's preference.